it's been a few days since I uploaded that last video and uh, I've had some thoughts about my printer and some suggestions uh, from the community so I have uh, uh, sort of an addendum and update to share with you guys uh, so let's get started so this is the printer right now I've I've uh, unhooked the driver board and stuff just because my cat was playing with it and I didn't want him to be messing with that stuff um, I have parts for it that are just sitting on there right now. Uh, there was a suggestion in the comments of the last video to, sorry, remove all these cables, to lower this center section, um, probably do it 10 millimeters or so, and then make the wiper also extend down that much so it, it wipes only within the boundaries of this box. So when I rebuild this box, I will absolutely be doing that. The only reason I'm not doing it now is because the, the center section is wood glued in and I used uh, brad nails from the side to pin it in place while the glue dried and I have brad nails right at the surface so it would be really hard for me to cut through this cleanly uh, to shorten that and plus in my apartment here I don't have uh, the tools to do that. The, this, those tools are all at uh, my parents house and I'm not planning on going home for a little while so this is the way it's got to be for right now. But once this all works and I can justify uh, building a second version of this box, version two will absolutely have the center section lowered uh, so that it everything is kept within the bounds of the printer. So thank you for that idea. That's an awesome idea and I'll absolutely be using that. So from that same commenter that commented about all that last stuff, uh, he also suggested I set up a Discord channel or server, not channel, set up a Discord server so that uh, I can get community feedback on what I'm doing. So I have decided to do that. So the link to join the Discord is down in the description below. So feel free to join and give me your suggestions, your ideas. I also wanted to talk quickly about the video quality in those last two videos. So I was using an app to edit the video on my iPad. Um, it was an app called VN, just the letters V and, v and N. Uh, and it works really well to edit, uh, especially on an iPad. Um, but I didn't realize that it was applying some kind of compression to the output. So I, I, I would rewatch the video right before exporting in the editor and it looked great in there because I'm recording all these clips at you know, 4K 30 frames per second. So they should look a lot better than they do. But you know, I, I'd watch back the, I'd watch back the final edit on my iPad and it looked fine but that was before exporting. So once I exported and uploaded to YouTube, there was some compression level, that was some compression that was going into it that was making it look all pixelated and garbly. So unfortunately I can't do anything about the already uploaded videos, but everything from this point going forward will be edited on my laptop instead. Not totally sure why I didn't do that from the beginning, but that's fine. So everything going forward should have the better quality, should be the, the good quality of my camera. Just a short little update. Uh, it's a little different than the build videos, but I thought that I'd keep you guys in the loop. Um, if you didn't watch this video all the way through, then I totally understand. But if you did watch all the way through, comment banana down below. I just want to see how many people watch all the way to the end. And so, um, but yeah, if you like this video, consider doing the thumbs up and liking it and all that stuff. I appreciate it. Uh, if you want to follow along with the rest of the build series as I get more parts for it and continue to build, uh, consider subscribing and uh, turning on the notifications so you see when I upload stuff. And if you uh, have any thoughts, join the Discord. Um, so that way you can share your thoughts with me and share your ideas on the project. Uh, or you can also just leave a comment down below. That works too. So uh, thanks.